Hello and welcome back to Dragon Out Ball Fighters. Hey, come here. Come here, Goku. Oh, I'm gonna get you, Goku. There you go. Get a wop and a wop. And a blast. Blister your blast. Kick and swap. Hey, nope, nope. Come here. There you go. Get in the combo. Da -da -da -da. Oh, you ain't ready, Ginyu. Told you you weren't ready. And blast the blast. Come on. Nope, come on. No, ow. There you go. I uh -huh, gotcha. Gotcha, Ginyu. And I gotcha. Oh, look at that. We found a Kid Boo. I don't even remember the last time we found a Kid Boo. Ow. There we go. Alright, come on, Boo. Come here. Come here. Get it. And... the Blasto. To pow. Get kicked. Get wrecked. Hit. Oh, get comp. Nope. Okay. Come on. Nope, there you go. And... Boo, you're done. Boo, you're... Done. Kick in the face. Huh. I never knew this place existed. Ooh. These labs exist all over the world. I don't even know how many there are. So there's more labs? Hmm. So where's 21? Now, resting in another room. She should wake up soon. I see. So, who is 21 anyway? Yes, who is 21? That's the question that I was wondering, too. She's an android that was created from the cells of countless warriors and brilliant researchers. She's even stronger than Cell ever was. Even stronger than Cell? Cell evolved through fighting Goku, eventually becoming stronger than the Cell we knew. No, he got stronger by absorbing you two. But, 21 is completely different. She already has more potential than Cell ever possessed. And her most dangerous quality is her urge to feed. She can power herself up endlessly by feeding on other creatures. So, if she doesn't eat, then she doesn't get stronger, right? So we take away all the food. Damn. So she is an even bigger monster than Cell. A monster? That's putting it lightly. Why does she absorb energy from other creatures anyway? This is just a guess, but I think some of the cells in 21 may be going berserk. What do you mean by berserk? Like her urge to feed takes on a persona that opposes her true nature. And what's her I true nature? Cells are. What do you mean? She has another violent persona lurking inside her? Yes. yes. It's constantly trying to surface, and she has to desperately keep pushing it back down. So, 16. What's up? Why would you work with someone so dangerous? Because she is the one who repaired me, in order for me to stop her from going mad. So she repaired you so that you could stop her. But she's stronger than you, and you can't stop her. Yeah, that does sound like you. Always the obedient one, even when your leader's a total nutcase. I don't think I've ever heard you talk this much, though. I find it annoying. I get the feeling you aren't just working with 21, because she ordered you to. Hmm. Huh. The silent treatment again. Looks like he's back to his old self. Ah. I'm sure he'll explain the rest eventually. We'll just have to ask him later. More importantly, is there any way to suppress 21's urge to feed? We should start there. Yes. That's why we started using the link system. And how does that stop the feeding? The link system was invented by Dr. Chiro. Are there more androids in those pods? Is there anybody in those pods? And 21 has used it in order to keep and another pod? control. 
And another pod? So if I understand you, all she has to do is link up and that's it? I don't know the details, but she said linking up is like rewriting one's mind. The technique allows the linked soul to freely control the host's body. I get it. I, like don't, I don't get system. it. It's an easy way to keep someone from rebelling against you. No wonder that old fart invented it. Maintaining a link was harder than Dr. Giroux originally conceived. Under most circumstances, people are unable to leave their bodies for extended periods of time. So even if the link is successful, most souls return to their bodies in less than a minute. Mm. However, in this case... I have no idea why the soul inside 18 has managed to maintain the link for so long. 16. Because I have no body. to try and utilize this soul's power? It wouldn't surprise me. I am sorry I kept quiet about this for so long. You should be sorry about that, 16. I needed answers back in, like, episode 1 on what was going on. The potency of your link was 21's last hope. Please, will you continue to lend us your strength? I don't even think I have a body, so... Really? You still want to help after hearing all that? What choice do I have? Help 21 not go psycho or go back to my own body where... It's the end of the world. Come on. Impressive. Talk about a good Samaritan. Nah, it just makes sense. So, no breaking the link. Until we defeat all the clones, right? So it doesn't matter. Our goal stays the same either way. Yeah, so then what was the point of all the clones then, though? If 21's urge to feed grows stronger, you won't be able to defeat her the way you are now. So we need you to get stronger. Yeah, that's what you say, but I've already beaten her twice now, so... <laughs> Some luck I have. Looks like we really picked the short straw here. At least there's fighting. And again, I just got more questions. But that's been this episode of Dragon Ball Fighters, and as always, thanks for watching.